What? Oh, I was gonna. I, 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 I thought you were talking to someone else. <laughs> I was talking to Slappy because he said by his book from the from Double Dash, and I think half the TD. Uh, the only one who's left is Diddy. And Paratrooper. Yeah, Diddy. Oh, yeah, 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 right, Paratrooper. Uh, also, uh, also, it sounds right, like. I would like to make the best character in the game. <laughs> yeah. I, I love the video. Oh, because he has a silver red shell. Oh, uh, another thing, uh, something else I want for Mario Kart 9. Give us mission mode again, please. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah I... What? You want boss fights back? Yes. I mean, um, that too, but like, I, I kind of just want mission mode, period. Like, just. I, I want more substantial single player content rather than just Grand Prix stuff. Yeah. Oh, that's good. Do you... <laughs> Sniped. Yeah. Oh, also, again. also, I, I, the, the, the word I was looking for when we were talking about like this B theme, is that they, like, compared to like the one in Galaxy One, they added another layer to what, uh, to the yeah. theme in this one. That's what I was. That's the word I was thinking of at the time. There. Yeah, layer of instruments. Yeah. Ah, okay. Okay. Oh, got it. Well, uh, uh, we can barely hear you, Jason. Really? Yeah, it sounds like you're um, underwater. Hang on, let me try something. Or oh, it sounds like you're like, uh, you're, you're like, you have a pillow over your face. <laughs> He's really sleeping. <laughs> Do I sound any better? Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. yeah, that's better. Yeah. Okay. Floaty stuff. Oh yeah, the stuff from Ghosty Garden. Flo floaty flop. Oh, floaty stuff. oh, is that what? You... That's what happens when you read too quickly. I'm gonna go with floaty stuff because it's funnier. Hmm. Um. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I don't. Really, uh, I guess going going off of the um, like the Mario stuff. Um, before we go into like the the big the big one, um, how do you guys feel about that Princess Peach game? <laughs> I'll tell you when I actually see some substantial gameplay. Fair enough. You know, yeah, I, yeah. I will say this. Uh, I do like. It seems like they're going with a um, like a like stage play backdrop, which. I've never really seen that be done before in a game to that, since, like... Yeah, since Mario 3, at least. Well, I mean, like, uh, to, to that level. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 okay. To, like, yeah, to... Because yeah, yeah. I, 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 I know there's, like... There's, there's levels that have, like, a stage play, but I mean, like... I don't, I've never seen a whole game do it. I mean, oh, yeah, 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 not the whole game. Because um, I, yeah. I, I was about to say, like, doesn't Paper Mario kind of do that with its battles? That is true. I've heard normally that where the audience is, like, interactable to the fights and all that. Because, that is like, cool. There's, like, a few of the boss fights you can use. One of the boss fights you can use to get the audience and everything. Yeah. Yeah, it's definitely... It's, it's hilariously cool. <laughs> yeah, it's... Yeah, point... <laughs> yeah, point is, though, like, it's been, like... Stage play stuff has been done before in games, but I've never been- I've never seen it be done in the way they seem to be doing with the Princess Peach game, so I- Like, like, in, in terms of, like, the general concept, it definitely has my attention just of how- Because of how, like, unique it seems to be. Um, and that this is actually a secret style savvy sequel. <laughs> get to. A lot of people seem to- Like, it se seem to, um, I mean, this is, like, speculation, but, like, I, I've heard the uh, sentiment that it kind of looks like it's going for a beat em up style, which for a Peach game, that would definitely be different. <laughs> yeah, that's interesting. That's like the last thing you'd expect from a Peach game. A, da a Daisy game, maybe. Oh yeah, that feels like more of a... Oh god. Uh, Queen Bee is back. Oh god. No. 
Yeah, I still think it's, it's funny, like, a, a lot of people thought that she that she replaced Waluigi, but it turns out the devs actually forgot about him. Wait, really? Yeah, like, Wait, what? How, do you, how do you forget Waluigi? I, well, the, I, I need to... I, I, what? <laughs> what? It's not great. I, uh, that, that doesn't make any sense. Like, not even just, like, the, the fact that, like, Mario Kart 7 has Waluigi's Waluigi Pinball. Like, what? It was just a, did they just remake that track and just, like, oh, wait. Like, Probably added the track after the fact. <laughs> <laughs> um, actually, actually, wasn't, um, for, remind me about that game. Was it, was it just that one stage, or was the whole game, like, made by Next Level? Mario Kart 7 have... was predominantly made by EAD Next Level. Wait, Next Level? I thought you retro assisted with Mario Kart 7 now. Yeah, it's retro, not Next Level. Uh, no, oh, retro, right, sorry. Okay, so, okay, okay, so, okay, I found a thing. Like, Waluigi said, so someone asked, and like, and, like, and, and one of the devs says, like, Waluigi's omission from Mario Kart 7 was hard for one of us here, was a hard one for us here at Nintendo. It was due to constraints associated with the Christmas deadline. Okay, so, uh, like, they, so, like, they, he, he, so, he wasn't added during development at the very least? Okay. Probably just I mean, bitter, so but they just ran out of time. Okay, that, that, that's what it sounds like. Cause like the idea that they just forgot about Wadawichi is like that's so, what the yeah. Hell? Oh, yes, sir. That'd be so yeah. upset. Like, okay, like, uh, yeah, just be, yeah, it's because that's because they had to rush the game out for 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 the holiday. Fair enough. It's pretty really funny that that people are going into a mainline game before Wadawichi. Yeah. yeah. I uh, I, mean, I mean I like. Uh, he debuted in mainline, so. Well, I mean, I mean, why do we? Why do we? You not being in seven gives off similar energy to Ice Climbers not being in Smash Four because there's like clear, clearly like remnants of them in the game. Like Waluigi Pinball in seven, and like in Smash 3DS, you see like the polar bears from the uh, Ice Climbers like game. So it's like, it's just so weird. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it's, 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 more hard, it's more hardcore limitations than anything. I was, yeah. I was gonna say, to be fair, with the um, in the case of the uh, polar bears, that could just be a case of just losing my hope. Yeah, you know, yeah. I, I, I get it. Yeah, it is. I, I get why they're, they're in a nice no, climb zone. It's just, it's just so weird when like you see stuff that a character or a series is like representative of, but like the actual main character or characters just aren't there. It's just, I don't know, it's just weird. Yeah, like, yeah, it doesn't even remind me of the fact that, like, um, the sneaky spirits from Rhythm Heaven are in Smash Run, but there's no Rhythm Heaven character. Hmm. I mean, I guess with, I, I guess with that, like, uh, uh, I'm the guy that just dropped, like, a shit ton of power up, right? Wait, what? About what? The sneaky spirits. I'm the guy that just dropped a shit ton of power up, right? I think so, yeah. I don't remember what a lot of the Smash Run guys do at this point. I haven't played that in years. Twitter? Wait, oh, you did. Oh, no. Surely oh. you remember the orange, though. The what? Orn. The Orn. Oh, God. Oh, God. Yep. Yeah. What is that? Chance the Kid Icarus out of me. Oh, the big giant, yeah. the giant skull? Yeah, yeah the, the giant skull. Yeah, 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 oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I, I remember that, yeah. Yeah, the instant kill skull. It has its own foreboding music. <laughs> yeah. Sakurai bias. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. There was there was one hundred percent of Sakurai bias in Smash. To the Smash. How many Kid Icarus? How many Kid Icarus enemies were in the Smash one? Yeah. Yeah. There's a lot. Yeah, a lot of Kid Icarus a enemies. Lot a lot of laugh at reuse. Yeah, a lot of Kid yeah. Icarus enemies as well as as well as as well as like a lot of Kirby enemies. I guess like to to give Sakurai a little bit of slack, like. Um, it, it, to to some deg degree, I get it. Like he, um, like he, <laughs> these are he knows these guys the most out of anyone in the cast. So like the the Kirby and the Kid Icarus yeah. guys, I mean. So yeah, because yeah, because yeah, they because yeah, they, they were his creations. Too. Yeah. So I, I I get it. Yeah, and of course, like and of course, like and uh, as well as them, there being a lot of Mario enemies, that's a given because you know Mario's the head, the face of Nintendo. Yeah. <laughs> if we're if they. About again? Oh, we're talking about Smash Run stuff. Smash Run. I was gonna no, say. Before that. Uh, before that, um, the Peach game. No Mario Kart and Waluigi's absence, I think. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. 
goes down to Russia to meet a deadline. And then it's just, like, and it's just, that just became a whole tangent how it turned into how the ice climbers were cut, and now we're talking about Smash Bros. Yeah, apparently. Uh, well, I, I, I <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't really, I, I, yeah, I, I don't have much else to say about the Peach game. I'm just, I, I definitely want to keep, keep an eye on it, because it, it, it's, it's fascinating, like, um, until we get an, ac an actual, like, title, I'm just going to call it Super Princess Peach 2. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. Because, like, when did that game come out? Like, I want to say, like, 2004 or 2000, actually, no, 2005. Uh, 2005. Yeah, yeah, 2005. That, that, right? Yeah, that, that game is kind of yikes in today's, like, just in general, because, like, um, Peach's, like, ability is, like, the fact that she can, like, change her emotion on the fly, and it's, like, kind of yeah. not the best representation. <laughs> Yeah. An emotionally powered platform. I get what you're doing, but... It... Crap. Nice. Um... <laughs> <laughs> I can't... I can't... I love the slow push up. The slow push up is really good. <laughs> yeah, I, I can't be mad at that. That was funny. <laughs> um... Yeah. No, it's like... Yep. Yeah, but... Super Princess Peach was made at a different time. <laughs> yeah. I hear we're making fun of that when it was new. Yeah. I kind of- I, I, I want to play it, uh, like, someday, but, like, it's- Just the fact I that it exists. Game, I, heard, I heard the game is okay. Yeah. Yeah, the, game, the, yeah, the, the game's not bad. Yeah, no, I, I- It seems like a fine enough 2D platformer. It's just, like... The, the mechanics are questionable. <laughs> Yeah. It was made. It was, like, it, was, it was also. It was also made by the same. It was made by the same dev teams who did the Starfy games. Oh, cool. I can tell you better. I can kind of tell you better looking at the art style. Yeah, and plus, like, and plus, Starfy even makes a ca Starfy even makes a cameo in some levels. Also, this gamer oh. likes to punish himself. Oh, did you, you then? <laughs> yeah, he's just. Yeah, that Guillermo's a masochist. Yeah, he just stays there taking the hits all like forever. Oh, right now I'm thinking of friggin' friggin' Joe from Family Guy. Bring it on! I can't do the voice, but you know what I mean. Yeah. yeah. Uh, wait, wait, what's it? Oh, Joe the from Family oh, Guy oh, screaming, oh, bring it on. Yeah. The, y the Y2K episode where it's just like the giant rat could fight. Bring it on! Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I can't Sorry, do Joe. I can't do Joe Swanson's like yeah, it's way too. <laughs> Yeah. Tanner, I think Tanner can do a Patrick Warburton impression. Yeah. Yeah, honestly, like, the, 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 be the best that I could do is a beater. <laughs> beater. Yeah. Beater. Yeah. It's like, Krunk's creator mentions Patrick Warburton. He... Oh, wait. No, no, he was like actual, like, character conceptualizer. At the oh, okay. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, sorry. Hmm. Guy who animated him for Emperor's New Groove, like he teaches classes at a college, and yeah, I guess every time he mentions that he created Krunk, every student always tries to do an impression. <laughs> That's, That's amazing. Um, yeah. Okay. Sorry. Yeah. Um. So okay. So just. With, talking about this level for a second, I, I this is a really cool level. I like the uh, it, it, it's a little bit more puzzly. Like a, um, it's like a Rube girl, yeah, Rube Goldberg contraption. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I mean, stuff like that I just think is fascinating and just fun to look at. Um, but yeah, I guess we should start talking about the elephant in the room. <laughs> ah, finally. Yes. Metal Gear. Yeah. 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 Metal Gear, yeah, Metal Gear, jump into the Switch, finally. No, 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 you're right, yeah, you're right. Okay, 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 do you, do you want to... Why did I turn the Switch? Yeah, okay, do you, do you guys want to just, like, uh, steamroll through, like, this stuff real quick? Okay, I'm gonna start, okay, I'll start with this since I'm pissed about it. Bat uh, Batman on the Switch, it ports Kingdom Hearts. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. Right. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. The bat, yeah, the Batman Arkham games running na running natively on Switch. Um, PS3, PS4, PS3 generation, by the way. Yeah, um, yeah. I, I'll say this: the 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 the, <laughs> the most I can say about the uh, Arkham collection is that 
Nintendo are out to get me because I, um, I, damn it, I, um, I bought Arkham City on the PS5 like a week ago, um, and then they just announced it coming to Switch like literally a couple, like a week later, and it's just like, at least it, damn it. it. Wow. At least it was dirt cheap. Buy Arkham Origins next. <laughs> at least it was dirt, at least it was dirt cheap, right? I mean, I guess, but I would prefer like I'm I'm gonna wait for like reviews to see like how well the games run on Switch because if they if they're like good ports, I'd prefer to play on Switch honestly. Um. But yeah, I, I'm happy for the collection. I'm I'm happy for the Metal Gear stuff as well because I've never played those games and it's a good excuse to do that. I don't have much to say about it beyond that because I've never played them so. I'm terrible at this game. But Harry, I, I, also, I, I also like the fact that the old, that, that the OG Metal Gear games are even are also included. Oh yeah, that was really cool. I I didn't expect that. Like they, that collection is like kind of popping off. <laughs> yeah, and, then, and, and yeah, that's volume one. Color. Oh. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, we have to keep in mind that this is volume one. Who knows what's gonna be in volume two? Right. Um, I. I'm glad you brought, brought up um, Arkham Origin Scrappy because it's so weird that like they seem to just keep pretending the game doesn't exist and it's just so weird. Well probably because it's not made by um, uh, Rocksteady. I mean yeah but I feel like it still deserves to be there. Cause it's, it's... I mean I remember enjoying it quite a lot. Hmm. Oh yeah, what's that? Uh, what was it? Oh uh, yeah, um, what was like the, that 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 what that one three D platformer game with like the yo yo mechanic? I forgot what it was called. Um, that one, like, cool. Are you talking about the oh, yeah. Sonic Mania dev uh, yeah, game? Yeah, yeah. yeah, that's what. Yeah, that's what I want to keep. Like no, 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 no. Uh, oh. Penny's Big Breakaway. Yeah, uh, yeah, that, yeah. That's the name of it. That yeah. one. Yeah. Yeah, like it's the, it's being made by the Sonic Mania devs, and it's like. Oh. Yeah. I want to. Yeah, that that looks really cool. It's Sonic Mania. Okay, you get my money. It's like, it's like Sonic Mania says, okay, also Ballad Wonder World. Oh no! Because I, I, yeah, I, um, yeah, you can just look at that and you, you just see, like, you, you just be like, yeah, th this was definitely made by Sonic fans. <laughs> yeah. Because it, 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 I it, Spring it, Mario was it in this game. Unfortunately. <laughs> um, nah, the worst for you, one. maybe. Yeah, I. I'm kind of indifferent to this to the spring. Um. So are you indifferent to the summer? Ha. <laughs> Lol. Um. I am a dad. <laughs> are you actually? Bring it on. Zero <laughs> still taking the hits. Man, what a trooper. Yeah, he's still her. Um. Yeah, trying to think. Like, is there anything else uh, from the direct that like, interested any of you? Um, I mean, like, I, oh yeah, I guess, I guess, like, um, the fact that Pikmin one and two are now really, really are now on are now on Switch. Which is, the fact, like, the fact that now you can play every mainline Pikmin game on the Switch that was pretty cool. Mm. Yeah, that is nice. I, yeah, but they're not a body placement, so why bother? <laughs> Yeah, actually, yeah, 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 like, yeah, they, yeah, they took out the product placement, it's actually the worst game now. <laughs> <laughs> also, Detective yeah, the... Pikachu, like, that caught me off oh, guard. Oh, yeah, 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 that game, right. Yeah, because I, I, guess, DLC. I, yeah, Pokemon yeah. DLC, I mean, that was expected, I did, I, I actually did, I actually, I actually, I actually thought they were going to talk about Pikmin 4 at the beginning of the direct instead of the Pokemon. I thought, yeah, oh, yeah, we yeah, haven't yeah, talked yeah, about Pikmin 4 yet. Yeah, 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 we actually haven't talked about Pikmin 4. Actually, with that said, like, yeah, I was expecting it to be at the end, but when it wasn't, and they, I, I was expecting, okay, it's gonna be Breath of the Wild, or uh, Tears of the Kingdom DLC or something. Okay, I got, I, okay, before we move on to, like, the, uh, like, Pikmin 4 and all that other stuff, um, the Tears of the Kingdom section was so weird, because it basically boiled, <laughs> yeah, it basically boiled down to, hey guys, thanks for playing our game, here's some Amiibo. Okay, moving on. Yeah. So what the hell? Thanks for, <laughs> thanks for giving us your money. Give us, give us more of your money. Maybe, maybe, they're, just waiting, maybe they're just waiting a little longer because the game I, literally just came out. Yeah, like, yeah. The, but it's so like you feel like I don't know. It's just 
such a weird I, I thing. Don't, I don't mind. I, I mean, I personally don't mind because, you know, they don't need to have DLC out immediately. Right. I know. I feel like... Why uh, doesn't engage? <laughs> I feel like if there's going to be DLC, DLC for Tears, um, it's probably going to be like in, like, a direct... Like, like so, so a, a direct near the end of the year or something. Mm -hmm. I'm also... Although, I'm now reminded of how Fire Emblem Engage, like, almost instantly gave all its DLC out. <laughs> I mean, that kind of, that would kind of check, uh, check out if the, what I've heard about it is true, where the game was done for a while. According to what Maddie is saying. Yeah. Like, I keep on forgetting that game came out this year. <laughs> I, I need to finish it, God. You know, I'll do the Boulder Bowl thing now. What was I going to say? Uh, what else? I had to, I've actually oh. had too many games in mind, so I couldn't really finish it. Mm. Oh, it's oh, yeah. Alright, yeah. Superstar's got some more footage, that looks nice. Oh, yeah, yeah, that. Yeah, I mean, I pretty much said my piece on Superstars from, like, a couple sessions back, but, um, we got full, uh, confirmation from the direct guy that it's gonna have, uh, what is it, 12 zones, which I'm fond of, I'm fond of that amount. I think that's uh, about, huh? Twelve original zones, right? Yeah, twelve original yeah. zones. Like I'm, I'm totally fine with that amount of uh, stages. But what That's a longer than like the average two. Green Hill. Uh, Green Hill is no more. Yeah, boy. The LP. Oh. Yeah. Right, <laughs> right, 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 right. Wow. Hey, I, was, I, was, I, was, I was about to say, what if they bring it back as a bonus, as a bonus level? God. What, SAQ style? Yeah, like, yeah, wow. like SAQ style. Like, just, you just go for Green Hill Zone as a bonus level. Oh god! Called, yeah, we have that. Oh. It's called it's called the first level of Sonic Mania. <laughs> yeah, I get get that give that place a, a rest. Like, if you're gonna do a, like a bonus level, and, and like have it be and, and chemical plant, please. If, if you're gonna have like a Green Hill type stage, make it like Seaside Hill or something instead. Wait, what? Oh, wait, I, I that, that's say, Sonic I Heroes, not for Sonic 4. Splash Hill. Okay, I haven't played Sonic 4 in so long. I don't think anybody has. <laughs> yeah, for good reason, because that game's not good. I mean, right. it, okay, okay, I'm gonna fight you on that. I don't think it's great. I, but I, I, I think, think it's it, fine. I think the game is fine. I don't think the game is like. The... It's, a, it's a very, very. Middle of the road, six out of ten. I think. Yeah, no, I, I don't think it's bad. It's just inc it's, it's slightly above mediocre. Yeah, like I could play it, but fast I could play it. Yeah, I, I, I like if someone like were to ask me to play it, I would. I just like it's not gonna blow you okay, away. Okay, we know what Harry's next let's play is gonna be. I've already played Sonic Four. Well, how, long, again. how long ago was that? I don't know, like five years ago. Five years, probably more than I. I don't remember, dude. I don't keep track of this stuff. <laughs> Again, I will say it's. I will say it's rather weird. Like Sega has released a good deal of <clears throat> controversial Sonic games. They don't memory hold them like they memory hold Sonic Four, though. I feel you like they, yeah, apparently they still memory hold Sonic of Six. <laughs> I, f I mean, I feel like they just want to forget Sonic Four even happened. Like, sorry, Captain Toad. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. I, it's like, wow, they really didn't like what Dims did, did they? <laughs> well, I mean, I mean, it's also, like, kind of cursed them now, because, like, they can't, like, I, I bet you they wanted to, um, if they, if they could, they would have called, like, Mania or Superstar Sonic 4, but they just can't now. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, look at Crash Bandicoot, they just didn't give a crap when they were numbering stuff again. That's true, I mean, to be fair. Well, the, thing is, or, or the problem is, Sonic fans never forget. I mean, the thing is, like, Rougher Cortex was very clearly trying to be Crash 4, but at the same time, you can get away with it because it was never titled Crash 4. So you can kind of... Yeah, unless you're Japanese, which, fair enough. But in the, in the case of, like... like what, case, they got two Crash 4s. Yeah, they got two Crash 4s. So then again, we have... Everyone has uh, two Crash 2s, so... But, like... Yeah, um... Th they can, like, loot... Uh, what is it? Loophole it with, uh, with in regards to Crash Four. It's like the Sonic Four thing is like, mm, mm. <laughs> kind of. Was a collect Goomba? Yeah, collect Goomb. 
You, are we that's a really, that's a weird, that's a weird task to have. <laughs> yeah, it's really weird. Yeah, that's that's why I cleared out the the planet, uh, the planet, because if you still have all the things rolling around, it's just a complete disaster. Da 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 da. <laughs> so cute and ferocious. They're not collectible, Zermo. Uh, they're living beings. <laughs> wow, like, wow, like, would, would you, you, I guess you could tell we were clearly doing a you got the thing, right? Yeah. Yeah. Um, well, I, I was that, that, that was cer that was certainly a lonely Goomba, but he wasn't stuck between two pipes. Well, then no Game Boy for it. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> but is he gonna be? I don't watch but that in a while. But is he gonna uh, uh, be gaming for the rest of his life? No, Maybe. because he's not stuck. Because he's not stuck between two pipes. <laughs> I haven't watched only Goomba in a while. It's oh God, this one. <laughs> um. Yeah, I, 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 I'm there right on and off with Lonely Goomba. Oh boy, oh boy, don't tell me you brought a Guillermo with you this time. Well, put it somewhere out of the way. Ayo, ayo, yo, yo, Lubba, is that hey, racist? <laughs> Maybe you'll want to relax for a bit? Uh, yeah, uh, hash, hashtag fire Lubba. <laughs> <laughs> That's why we don't see him anymore. Wow. He got, he got cancelled, Lubba. <laughs> oh, nice. Uh, NPC actually giving me a one-up. Yeah. Um, That's what you get for enslaving a Goomba Mario. <laughs> one single one-up. Yeah, boy. Um, okay, so... I feel like we're, um, we're, we're, we're going, like, all over the place with, like, our commentary today. Um, yeah, um, what, what yeah we, we, still, we, we still haven't talked about Pikmin 4 yet. You go ahead. Yeah, I'm, okay, we might as well talk about that now. Yeah, 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 because, um, yeah, like, um... Because I, 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 I do like that that game does look like yeah. it's going to be no, Pikmin no. 2, but better. I hope so, because, uh, dude, I, I just want to go up. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm saving a comment for comment for later, because that one's a doozy. Um, yeah, Pikmin Pim 4 definitely looks really good, because I, I, yeah. cause I, 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 I think I do like the idea of, like, the cave system and, like, all, a lot of stuff that 2 does. I just don't think it's done super well in that game specifically. Yeah, so, it's, like, uh, it, like it's, 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 it was all, it was all, like, basically, like, just because of, like, the RNG elements of the caves. Yeah, that, and I feel like, um, uh, I don't know, I, I, I don't know if this is an unpopular opinion, but I feel like a lot of the caves in Pikmin 2 are a bit too generic. I feel like if they were more, they, they were more, uh, they had more interesting designs or gimmicks or, um, like, puzzles and stuff, I'd like them more, yeah. but a lot of them are just kind of generic maps with enemies around and stuff and it's it kind of gets older after a while I'm yeah i'm so glad to see the piazzas again oh yeah i love these guys yeah like yeah because I, I think i remember when i see when i saw like clips like when i saw previews for this i was expecting that this level would use a delfino plaza theme but this theme's good too i do like this yeah i do like this theme i i would have uh i would have preferred in this case if, the, if it was like a remix of like a one of the beach themes from Sunshine, or just a theme from that game in general, just because you know, there's there's meant to be calling back to that game, so you may as well go may as well go all the way. Look at yeah. Laughing for more rehash content. Shame on you. <laughs> I mean, if it, if if like the situation calls for it, I don't mind it. Cause oh, I, yeah, um... yeah. Yeah, this is definitely one of one of the most open stages in the game, which. Checks out because oh, yeah, that's true. checks out because Sunshine is like at at the time of this when this game came out was like the most open Mario game so yeah uh, oh yeah um, I guess I, I guess I, I, I guess going back to like Pikmin four the only other things I can say about it I do like is that I like the idea of the glow Pikmin and the fact that you that there's now night that there's now a night mode. I'm interested to see finally. how that goes, yeah. We finally have green Pikmin. Yes, and they glow in the dark. Oh yeah. Like, like, when I'm so SpongeBob. <laughs> yeah, at uh, we're, we're doing night exp we're doing expeditions at night. At night. <laughs> Um, I like it. One, one thing I hope for is like what like when the glow Pikmin do become marketable plushies, they better glow in the dark. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that'd be amazing. 
If they don't glow in the dark, then what's even the point of making them into marketable plushies? I love that meme. I love that meme where it's like, please, Nintendo, don't turn me into a marketable plushie. No! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's so stupid. We'll see and, like, and, and, yeah. and, 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 and I also like, and I also like that like the main character is tech is like technically, you're oh, it's technically customizable. Hmm. Yeah. I, uh, I'm probably just gonna make like a, a captain that just looks like Olimar because I just want to play as Olimar again, honestly. <laughs> I'll just make something stupid. <laughs> yeah, like Pikmin Four is doing a lot of interesting. <laughs> just stupid. No, just stupid enough. Yeah, Pikmin 4, like, is, uh, very, like, it, it seems to be, like, getting better every time we see it, because, like, uh, 3 is probably my favorite overall. I have the most nostalgic memories towards 1, but, um, I think, I think 3 overall is the best, best of the 3, so if, if we oh, can, if, if we can have a game that with the, with, at bare minimum, the quality of 3 with, like, like, on top of, like, all this new stuff, and it's, like, to the same quality, like, that, it's gonna be great. I just realized, yeah, I forgot you actually can actually swim in this game. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 because Al, 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 Del, like, Al Delfino Yoki's are built oh. different. Yeah, I, I do, I, I don't need to remember this, but I think you, like, Scrappy made the head cannon that, like, they melt in water because they're, like, probably made by Shadow Mario. That sounds about right. That's, like, the only way that makes sense to me, so... Um, yeah, this okay, is just a yeah, night. Uh, and I, 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 I think, and I think we've talked about pretty everything we wanted to talk about. Um, so, well, I mean, I, I wasn't quite. Well, I mean, I, I guess the other thing about Pikmin Four is like that, that two, two things. I, I hope whatever the battle mode stuff ends up being, it better be online this time. <laughs> Oh yeah, please, please, Cause, uh, Nintendo. Because the, the battle modes in Pikmin games are really fun, but they're always local only. Oh man. Yeah, uh, the that's, other... that's the only disappointing part. Yeah, Pikmin 3 has like really good side content, so hopefully 4 has that as well. I can't um, believe you couldn't actually ride Yoshi and Odyssey. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah. Um, the, the, the other thing I had to say about Pikmin 4 is that the Dan Dory battle or whatever, like that thing that just looks like Olimar, like Ol Olimar Pikmin. And then like, people, <laughs> and it's like everyone's just like freaking out. It's like, wait, is this like an alternate timeline where the Pikmin one bad ending is canon? <laughs> you got noise. Like, uh, like, like, no, uh, uh, like, uh, uh, like, uh, honestly, like, my, my first thought when seeing this thing is, uh, it looks like, um, have any of you guys ever seen that one, sh that that Netflix show called Hilda? I heard of it. Heard of it. Mm, I haven't seen it. Oh, it's re it's a really good show. Um. Like it's, it's, yeah, it's a really good show. Like it reminded me, like the designer reminded me of this like one character named Tantu. I think like I think it was, I think it was like really big hair, like the like the face is mostly covered in hair and big nose. Mm. So that was the first thing that came to mind when I saw that character. Hmm. This is a really easy comment medal to miss, by the way. Yeah. Still at row between two Nagi. Oh Nagi. Yeah. There's two of them. <laughs> Um, yeah. Oh, Scrappy died. Oh god. <laughs> no! We're going so well! <laughs> Wait, do I not actually have to be here? He's alive! Yeah! You, you gained a one-up, brought him back! Nice. <laughs> oh, oh, what I missed. Ah, uh, you just not missed much. it. We just finished talking about the big one. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, you're talking about SA1 remake, man. Oh yeah. man. Yeah. Big he's the big one. I, I really want to see the fishing in HD. I I wanna I wanna I wanna hear Tails say good thing you're a cat in HD. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, I will say this. Uh last Uh what is it? <laughs> I I guess like on the Sonic 4 thing a little bit good. I will, I will say this about the game. I, I genuinely think episode 2 is pretty good. Mm. So I was, I, I'll, I'll say, I'll, I'll leave things on off on that at least. Um, but yeah, I... I Don't mix food, Harry. It will end poorly. 
Um, th there's a th yeah. I, I I don't really have anything else to say about Pikmin 4, but like I'm looking forward to it. I, th there's like some other random games throughout the direct that I'm partial. Like I'm I definitely want to keep an eye on. Like the um, what is it the Star Ocean or whatever. Like the that. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Star Ocean oh, yeah, I saw Storm, that. I, I saw the Star Ocean remake thing, or in like yeah. using the. And you, it looks like it's trying to use the, yeah, it looks like it's trying to use like the Octopath Traveler like style. Yeah, yeah. I, I am, um, I am. Um, yeah, I, I was, I, as soon as they said like, uh, what is it? It's supposed to be like an action RPG, right? Yeah, because it kind of, yeah. it kind of gave me a Tales of Vine of some yeah. sort. Yeah, yeah. Well, I saw the gameplay and it was like, like real time. I was like, okay, now you have my attention. <laughs> Yeah, like I said, it, it, like with, the, with, the, with the battle reads, I get it. I, I, I got a very, like, oh, come on. Mid, mid, middle Tales of games. Like, it's like something like Vesperia. Hmm. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I definitely want to keep an eye on that. Um, I'm like, hmm, maybe. <laughs> oh, I just thought of something that, that, that um, Xavier could talk about. Uh, oh, yeah? Dragon yeah. Quest. Oh, oh yeah, Dragon, right, right. Yeah, Dragon Quest Monsters. The Dragon Quest Monsters game. I haven't Dragon played it. Dragon Quest <laughs> Yes. I mean, like, yeah, I, I haven't played the Dragon Quest Monsters game, but, but yeah, like, they are, they are basically Pokemon clones. Hmm. Because, yeah, you just catch different, dra different, because, because I, I, I do know that, like, Dragon Quest V does have a similar thing where, like, you can recruit certain monsters and they will fight with you, but, 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 like, but, but Dragon Quest Monsters is, is essentially just Pokemon. Right. It definitely yeah, gave off, it gave... No, I was gonna say it, it gave it definitely gives off that vibe. Yeah, for some reason, yeah. solo's there. <laughs> yeah, cause I, I, yeah, yeah, cause I, cause I think like uh, some people are saying, or because of that, some people are saying that this game takes place in the world of Dragon Quest IV, and are thinking that like the Dark Prince in the game is like a younger version of the main villain. Hmm. Well, wow. Sophia shows up. What? Oh, Sophia, the female hero of Dragon Quest IV. Oh, yeah, yeah, her. Yeah, 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 Sophia, yeah, the female, the, 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 the female Dragon Quest 4 hero. Okay, still there. Have you been in the Dragon Quest for a while, Traffic? I don't play Dragon Quest, but Nintendo Power covered the DS remake of 4, 5, and 6 pretty extensively, so I know the general cast of Dragon Quest 4 pretty well, and, you know, you know their designs had a crush on Maya, so, um... <laughs> I know the two. I know the two heroes, and I know Tornado got his own spin-off, which is what led to Mystery Dungeon. Right. Oh uh, yeah. Oh, oh Weech. Oh, uh, sure, go ahead. So I, I, I get. Yeah, I guess this I don't is. Feel like getting wet. Go ahead. The the Ouija finally gets to go to Discount Isle Delfino. Sounds about right. Hey Mario, did I tell you Maya's my favorite Dragon Quest character? <laughs> hey Luigi, time to go. Okay, I think. Uh, you you you, you mispronounced Jasmine. Okay, so. Okay, sorry. I I I well, think I. I think I've pretty much said like um all everything. Well, I'm a chuckster. I'm a chuckster. I'm a, ch I'm a chuckster. <laughs> I love this image. Where it's just like you know those memes where it's just like why she wanted to go to heaven but something something yeah I, yeah why she wanted to go to heaven but god said i'm a chuckster i'm a chuckster i'm a chuckster <laughs> Boop. or at the very least i've heard like that one yeah. yeah um okay so i i can't really think of any other games from the director i want to talk about besides mario so is there anything else like for the last second be like before we go into the big one is there any absolutely anything else you guys want to touch on uh, well they talked about persona 5 tactica and they didn't oh, right. tell me well but they, they told, told me everything i already know so yeah i i, I kind of forgot it was in there i i don't have anything to yeah i i don't more have anything to say about thing, it more interesting thing. More interesting thing wasn't even in the direct. It was on the it was on the Persona Central Twitter where they just talked, where they just said that um uh, um uh, Yoshizawa and Akechi are getting a separate DLC story. Oh. Hmm. Oh, that's interesting. So yeah, Kasumi and um yeah and, and Akechi. Yeah. yeah. I mean and, it, like, yeah. 
And I'm just like, this is day one DLC, aren't it? <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, I was gonna say, when I saw the Persona 5 stuff, I, it definitely had my attention, but I, like, as someone who hasn't well, played... Well, I mean, you can't really play that until you actually play Persona 5. So. Yeah, I was going to say, yeah. I, I can't, I don't really have much of a opinion on this, because I haven't played 5, so... I don't yeah, know. It, it's, uh, it's on the Switch, so now, you, so now there's no excuse. Yeah. I mean, the only excuse is, like, just time management. Uh... Yeah, that, that are we are we good to talk about the funny mar marrow now? I wonder what I, we're going to be talking about. Hmm. I'm going to give hmm. <laughs> I'm going to give Scrappy the floor floor with this one because I I feel like he's probably wanted to talk about this for a while. Um, I've actually been kind of dreading it, but okay. <laughs> so, um, they finally did the thing, made an yeah, quote unquote wholly new 2D Mario like. How we want to find Mario to run in the Maker games, but first, I guess, non Maker console exclusive 2D Mario since New Mario U and New Luigi U, which was a decade ago, so. Yeah. Yes, yeah. They, it's nice to see it back, and yes, they fixed the. Well, fixed, I say. They updated the art style for those who care about that. I'm not going yeah. to comment on it any more than I need to. Yeah, because like a lot of yeah. people have noticed that Mario was way more expressive in this compared to the new Soup games. I wanted to do a voice. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Anyway, uh, got yourself a pretty cool cloud thingy thingy there. That looks like fun. Lava, I know what you said about the gear, Mo. I'm I'm telling I'm telling Try to stay go. try to stay grounded. <laughs> hey. Please don't please don't please don't report me. This is all I have. <laughs> <laughs> try to stay grounded. <laughs> and me. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Alright, um, I'm actually gonna, I'm, I'm gonna use a washroom real quick. I'll okay. Be right back. So, this, this, yeah, the Cloud is like one of the only power ups that's actually on the star, that shows up on the star, uh, starship. And, uh, there's do just you, a secret. Do you do anything on here? Huh? Do you do anything on here? Because I never found a place for it. There's a, uh, one up. And that's it. Where? You just go up here somewhere. There you are. Oh, that's it? Cool. Yeah. That's. I mean, it, it's basically, I mean. I'm not so, I'm not so out of the way, though. I mean, it's still something. I mean, it's like, it's the equivalent to getting a one-up in the observatory, so it's like fine. Okay. Well, it just like it, just, it feels like a very obtuse like hiding spot. Well, I mean, it's supposed to be hidden. <laughs> um. <laughs> uh. Okay. So both of these are. Um. Get out of the way. Because uh, okay, there's this, and then there's the the Bowser Junior tit robot. Um, that is a daredevil run, and both of these are like not easy. Uh, just, just do this one. We'll, it might be better. It might be better if you just do Bowser Jr. and Bowser back to back. <laughs> I guess so. 